Today in the Fab Lab, we're cutting a load of bull roarers, although based on the Maori design. Slight differences, we have to make 150 of them. We're looking at bull roarers today. Well, that's uh, what a lot of people know of them as, especially people who watch Crocodile Dundee. Um, New Zealand Bari call them, amongst other things, uh, poo poo. The idea is you take one of these things, traditional designs, a little bit longer than this, and you stick it on well, about four foot of string and um, whirl it around your head and it makes a funny noise. I used to do this with uh, foot rulers when I was a, a young lad. Anyway, um, our uh, beloved staff at the school uh, designed this one and asked us to make a hundred, as we showed you earlier. Um, and they didn't actually work. We tried really hard. We tried putting the string on the end of a stick. Um, we tried using uh, very fine string, dental floss, actually. And uh, that didn't work either. So eventually, we settled on uh, this design here. And a few foot of paracord. And uh, as they say, let's give it a whirl. Well, let's try swinging it vertically. It takes a little while for them to wind up. That's a short string, try it with a longer string. Good day. I know. Let's try it with a stick. So with a shorter string on the stick, hopefully we shouldn't have to wind it up too much. That works quite well. Wonder what happens with a longer string. Um, how is my arc of fire safety person? I don't think it will hit a window. Alright. Wind up. Yeah, longer string, not necessarily better, but we have some good noises. Seasons can be a bit confusing in New Zealand because we're in the other hemisphere, so allow me to explain. Uh, at the start of the year in January, uh, we're actually starting with summer, and then um, we go into autumn, or fall as the Americans call it, but here we call it autumn. After autumn, uh, we have winter in the traditional manner, and following winter we have spring one. This is wonderful, glorious, sunny spring-like weather, which is followed after a couple of weeks by Schittsville. Schittsville lasts about three or four weeks and is then followed by spring two, which is the real spring, and then we roll on into summer again. Mad Max needs a new ammunition holder to put his bullets in, so we're going to try something a little different. There we go, the finished ammo holder. Hold it like that, little screw there snaps into a slot which has a slightly enlarged end hole so that it clips on the screw head like that. Clever thing is it dispenses five bullets first there, oops. and then you move it a bit further and you can dispense the next five and then there's your remaining ten and anyone who shoots cowboy will recognize 
the loading pattern. I've been talking to David and he says not as many lambs as we were expecting so um, yeah not a hundred percent success rate either so uh, as was once said of a friend of mine oh he must love being a sheep farmer he plants so many of them but for now that's your lot down on Geeko Farm. Okay, 